So I'm so excited, you guys. I just got these in the mail. They're Feel Grounds, they're barefoot shoes. These are their high top version. So in the past, they sent me the original, like the lower cut version. I've worn them to work pretty much every day. I've actually worn them out a little bit. They're super, super comfy. I just have the plain black ones in the, the lower cut version. So these are the black with white sole. They come in a bunch of different colors. I'll show you guys later. So I'm always a size U US 9 in women's and I find that that always translates for me to a 40 in European sizing. So this is the black and white. This is the company. Um, so I do have other barefoot shoes that um, from other brands that I love as well. I always wear them to the gym or for hiking, walking, um, like out in nature. This is more, in my opinion, this is more like a city everyday shoe. So it doesn't look like a barefoot shoe, but it's super comfy. So I like the back too. It just has their logo on it as well. Yeah, but I think out of all the colors, this would be my favorite color combination in my opinion. So I'll show you guys when I have them on what they look like. Hello you guys, welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Janice. So today this video is gonna be a review of Feel Ground's new higher top version of their barefoot shoe. So if you've watched my videos in the past, you would have seen a review I did of their lower cut version, which um, was the all black color. Obviously this has the white sole. Probably um, if I had to pick any color though, this one is my favorite. So I've said in videos in the past, I prefer to wear barefoot shoes just because for my own foot, my foot is a little bit wider. I'm pretty tall, so I have a little bit of a bigger foot. So in all shoes, I'm typically a women's size nine US, which equates to a 40 euro. So these definitely fit true to size. You can see the toe, it's foot shaped. There's room for your big toe to be nice and straight, which is the most important thing. They're also very flexible. So this is what you want. You want your toes to be able to move. Also, I feel like a lot of shoe companies, uh, barefoot shoe companies, they don't talk about this as a benefit, but this is kind of like a secret bonus or selling feature of barefoot shoes, if you will. Um, so when you plant your big toe, you're gonna activate your glutes more when you're walking. So myself, both uh, my brother, my boyfriend, both have barefoot shoes. They've noticed that as well. It's also healthier for your hips. Um, I don't have foot, I can walk for hours in shoes like this. I never have any problems. I can say, because right now the world's under quarantine, I've basically just been going out for a very long walk every day. So at least 10,000 steps, which is pretty far. I can say this is hands down the most comfy shoe I've ever worn in my life. I actually prefer the higher top version. I find it's more supportive around my ankle. So, so comfy. Even with some of my other barefoot shoes, if I wear them all day long, I will still have a little bit of toe pain in my big toe on my left foot where I have problems. This, not at all. Um, they're really breathable. I find my foot doesn't sweat as much in these. They're waterproof. Obviously, you know, you can add a water repellent spray over time. If you need to clean them, you can just clean them off with a little shoe brush or wipe them clean with a damp cloth. You could use, if you have the white sole version, a Mr. Clean Magic Eraser will get them nice and white again. But I love these. They, they match with everything. I tried them on with a few different outfits. I absolutely love these, you guys. So I'm going to leave my link in the down bar. This company is a company I would love to support and encourage you to support too, right? It's made by young entrepreneurs. Most of the material is made of recycled material. They're vegan, cruelty-free, so there's no leather on here. So if that's a concern for you, this is a great company. Um, they make sure to treat their employees um, properly pay them proper wages above the average in the area that these shoes are manufactured. I will say the price point might be a little bit more than what you're used to paying, but definitely keep these things in mind. I feel like now more than ever, we should be buying from sustainable companies, right? You know, fast fashion, it creates a lot of pollution in the world. I think, you know, right now with what's going on, a lot of the areas that are heavily polluted and people have lung respiratory problems, you know, that's where they're becoming the most sick. So I think going forward, it's better just to spend a little bit more money and then have something that lasts. I can attest to these shoes. I wear my um, the lower top version every day at work. 
So if you work in healthcare like me, this is great, right? Especially if you work in a hospital, I think I said that in my last video, if you're someone that gets a lot of steps in per day, I might as well wear these. It's uh, comfier for your feet, activates your glutes. Um, yeah, I just, I can't say enough about these. So you can see the back, it has the feel grounds up the back and there's lots of color versions. I like them all, but this personally, this is my favorite because a lot of us sit all day our hips, when they get really weak, it can sometimes affect how we're walking, right? So sometimes that can affect your feet as well. So even if you don't have foot problems, you should be trying to wear these. I mean, obviously, if you have a job where you have to dress up and you have to wear high heels, maybe you can't wear these to work, but on your off days, your weekends, if you go for a nightly walk, anything like that, I would definitely suggest that you wear barefoot shoes. I mean, I can't wear barefoot shoes 100% of the time, but I'm fortunate I do have a job where I can wear running shoes to work. So I would encourage you, um, it, because these are more stylish than other barefoot shoes, even if you have an office job, you could definitely get away with wearing this with black pants. Um, you could get the whole black version, like the ones that I have in the past video. So again, they're true to size. If you guys have any questions, just leave it in the comments below. I will link this specific model and the other ones in the down bar that I have so here's the shoes you guys so yeah i definitely don't really think that they look like barefoot shoes especially from the side i'll do a close-up right i think they look really good but look i can still lift my toes show you a close-up here so i'll show you with my coat on too right like they look so good i'm really happy with them You can move your toe normally. It's a great street shoe. And it looks great with jeans. It looks great with jeans too. I had them on earlier with jeans. So barefoot shoes mirror the shape of our natural foot with a wider toe box, which allows all of our toes to splay apart. So this really lets us plant our big toe into the ground as we walk. Because of this, usually your balance will be improved and your glutes are more activated. Barefoot shoes also let you go pain-free and allow you to be active for much longer than normal. They also help to strengthen all the small accessory muscles in and around our foot and ankle, and they provide much more sensory feedback from the ground to our brain while walking. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please consider subscribing and stay healthy. Bye.